Squirreling around on the table today, we have another Marvel Science Kit from Uncle Milton. This is the Iron Man Repulsor Ray Tech Lab. Uncle Milton toys give you a great chance to uh, try something different than the traditional action figure and uh, play with something a little more uh, interactive. This set looks like we're going to try to suspend a power blast in midair and move it through obstacles. Looks pretty entertaining. There's also a night training mode. On the back of the box here we have some of the elements of what it can do and it uh, looks like it takes a few AA batteries as well. Overall it looks like a pretty entertaining toy so we're going to test it out and uh, see how well it performs. Outside of the box we have a few items. We have the main Repulsor Ray technology piece. We have got two energy spheres, which are very light and fluffy by the way. And we have three obstacle pieces, each one uh, a little difficult uh, in varying degrees. There's also a neat little poster slash uh, information guide. Uh, this is kind of fun, you can throw up on your wall again. And uh, some fun science facts. And the instructions of how to work this fun thing. So, a pretty neat set. To install batteries, just flip over here to the bottom and unscrew with a Phillips screwdriver. And there we go. That is your repulsor ray. Once you have the batteries installed, it's not too hard to uh, get this thing going. Just simply uh, make sure it's on and uh, by pressing this base button here, starts up the fan and the lights and then you take your energy sphere and you pop it into the uh, the stream of air pulling back a little bit there you go looks like it hovers about six inches above the uh, repulsor ray and kind of does a little bit of action here You can kind of play with it a little bit, it definitely holds. Reminds me of those ball, uh, beach ball on fans at store displays. So now we're going to test out our skills with the first obstacle. And it's just a simple hoop and I bet you all you're going to do is go through it. So that's real easy. Your second one gives you a little less room and we'll go through there, just like so. Whoa. Nope. And then the third one is even tighter and uh, tricky to do on camera here. Looks like you don't want to block your airflow. There you go. Not bad. Kind of fun. I like it. For handheld use, just simply turn your uh, arm unit right here. Just nice on a really nice swivel, actually. That's quite strong. And now you can uh, do some testing. Oh, doesn't rotate or anything, just swivels. And now you can just do some, you know, running around the room testing. And it's obviously a little harder this way because you're moving the base more. And so that's where the challenges start coming in. They recommend you tape these to walls and books, you know, fit this in between a book and then walk by and then try to get the ball, the energy uh, ball through. So that kind of gives you some fun uh, distractions. I like it just for this though. The tabletop is all, all I need for fun. And of course it has a light up effect. You can do some nighttime training. Of course everyone's going to ask, what happens when you put two energy balls on the device? Well that's what I'm here for. Oh, <laughs> one obviously deflects the other, but that might be something you can play around with. In the end, there's just a lot of different little tricks that you can master with this thing. So that is the Iron Man Repulsor Ray Tech Lab set, and it's pretty fun. I think you've got a few different things to keep your mind going with it. It's definitely more of an active set than, say, the other uh, Milton set the Iron Man Arc Reactor uh, set, Build Your Arc Lab. This one was a lot of brain challenging fun, or this one's a little more challenge your uh, hand-eye coordination type of thing. You can find these over at Toys R Us and Amazon.com. That's what I'm gonna say about that. Thanks for watching Squirrel Stampede.